Buildings on top of vehicles in Japan after Monday's earthquakes. It's a scene not as common in Canada. After all, even with more than 4,000 quakes detected yearly across the country, one like the 7.6 magnitude quake that hit Japan is rare. But geologists like Christy Rowe say the chance for something even bigger is there. It's the kind of place where a 2011 Tohoku earthquake could happen and has happened in the recent past, will happen again in the future. That quake hit near Japan's east coast at about a 9.0 magnitude. And while we don't know when it will happen, scientists say a big one is likely to hit BC. Though they are more common on the west coast, quakes can happen in Ontario, Quebec and as far east as Atlantic Canada. They happen all across Canada and everybody should be aware and prepared. From updated building codes to withstand quakes to education campaigns, preparedness is a constant job. Ottawa will also be rolling out a national early warning system this year to help ensure readiness from both the public and officials. Critical infrastructure operators should should also be using this information to open doors, shut off valves, uh, stop trains, close tunnels, stuff like that. When experiencing an earthquake, Camille Briand notes people should drop to the ground, take cover under a sturdy table and hold on until the shaking stops. The Insurance Bureau of Canada is also warning of what that shaking can do to its industry. Craig Stewart says earthquake hazard risks have gone up, and that means a cost to many. Not only are insurers exposed, but more consumers are exposed because they're not covered to the same extent as they were previously. He says the federal government should look into a national insurance program so people and businesses are insured by companies that are backed up by Ottawa. Experts say the most important thing Canadians can do to prepare is have an emergency plan and a kit with things like food and water that will last at least 72 hours. This is because depending on the size of a quake, you could be waiting for some time for help to arrive. Sean Preville, Global News.